he shouldn't have access to, but he's directing his uh, staff uh, to hide the information and lie for him. And so uh, I think it undercuts certainly uh, admiration uh, for the United States. John Bolton, the former National Security Advisor, conservative, said that uh, Trump has done enormous damage uh, to our country, and I believe that to be the case. I mean, when you read the transcript of the former president saying to a room full of, of just people who were there uh, to, you know, hear from him and suck up to him, none of whom had security clearances, saying, you know, this is highly confidential, it's secret, this is secret information, look, look at this, and showing them a document, I mean... Did you ever imagine a, a president or somebody who had been president would do that? Well, well Anderson, uh, I felt that he was unfit to be president, unfit to be commander in chief from the be very beginning. I felt that uh, initially. Uh, I didn't vote for him and I spoke out against him because I saw his character shining through, how he criticized uh, John McCain not being a hero, how he embarrassed uh, a reporter who had a disability, how he uh, actually criticized a Gold Star family during a, a convention. All of that told me uh, that the car he was lacking in, uh, in character and there was morally bankrupt. And as far as dealing with our, our men and women who serve us, he's in Arlington National Cemetery looking over the grave sites with John Kelly, General John Kelly, whose son is buried there, and says, what was in it for all of these people? What was in it was the fight for democracy, which is something that he uh, apparently doesn't really understand. Yeah. Uh, Secretary William Cohen, I appreciate your time.